Hey Crush, here's your video for the week. Uh, I'm recording this pretty early in the week because so I'm going to be gone uh, over the weekend. But I'm going to talk about just one quick announcement. Uh, on the 3rd, December 3rd, at around 11 o'clock, uh, Dawson has a baseball or basketball game that morning, so I'll be here around 11. Uh, if you want to come by and help do some stuff around the gym, I would take the help. I'll have some supplies here today. As I record this, is on a Tuesday. Uh, I should be getting my other shipment of stuff. We're going to get... The other stuff I ordered was um, additional rig, so it's not the same rig, it's a rogue rig, so it's going to go, um, I know everybody likes to kind of camp out back this way, so I'm not going to put the rig back here, I'm going to put the rig uh, up front, that's why I moved uh, the kettlebells, the dumbbells, and the GHDs back a little farther, so we're going to put another rig right here, it's not a big section, it's basically, or not basically, it is, um, see if I can get the camera here, like this four foot section here, where you squat and then a six foot section. So there's another 10 feet with a rig. Um, we'll have two more spaces to squat and then a long section for more pull-ups. I'm gonna put some of these bars lower so they're like the end of the rig down here for the ladies and the short folks like myself that like the short bars. And this can go up front. We're gonna hook that up and then we're gonna try to figure out, we have some smart guys in here that are a lot better with uh, tools and stuff than me. They're gonna help me hang the rings. We finally get the rings up so we can do some muscle ups or some stuff like that. And then lastly, uh, back here, where eventually we'll have um, barbell clubs. So the barbell club will, will start uh, after the first of the year. We're going to wait till after the first of the year to start that. We're going to build some lifting platforms back here. Um, places where we can do Olympic lifts, have an actual piece of plywood, some hard platforms to do your lifting. And I, part of the stuff I'm getting today also are three good squat stands. So not like these little things here that kind of wobble. They're the really good squat stands from Rogue. I'm getting three of those today as well, as long as some other odds and ends stuff. So on December 3rd, around 11 o'clock, if you want to come help build the platforms, set up the rig, install the rings, uh, I'll definitely take the help. There's quite a few people coming already, but the more the merrier. I have a couple ladders here, but we're going to need ladders for the rig. We're going to need ladders for the rings. So if you have ladders, you can bring that. Uh, if you have any tools you think will be helpful, I know we have a couple people with good drills. That'll be able to drill into the concrete and drill into the concrete on the floor and get that done. Um, but come help. December 3rd, around 11. I think if we have all the people coming and some of those guys, especially the rings, concern me because I'm just, for me, it seems like impossible to drill in the concrete and hang rings from there, especially have rings sturdy enough to hold somebody like myself from the rings. Um, but they think it's going to be not too bad to do. So uh, hopefully it doesn't take too long. Hopefully it takes a couple hours. Uh, the platforms won't be too bad. I actually don't think setting up the rig will be too bad. Um, but if you want to come December 3rd around 11 o'clock, when we get done, I'll walk, we'll walk over here to uh, Six Cap and I'll buy you guys a beer or two or three. And then remember December 10th, we have the Crush Christmas party. That is at uh, 6 o'clock-ish. I'll provide the alcohol. At least I think I'll provide the alcohol. I know some of you guys are pretty, pretty particular what you drink, so if you're really particular, you can bring something. But there'll be beer, there'll be white, uh, white claws, trulies, that kind of stuff. I'll bring some harder alcohol too. White Elephant starts around 7, 7.30. Um, spend 20, 30 bucks on the White Elephant, not much more than that. Uh, make something, a goofy gift, a silly gift, a really cool gift, a gift that people want to steal. We definitely need some of those. So you pick. Wrap it. Uh, don't put your name on it, obviously. Uh, and then we'll get that going. Uh, last year we had like 30 or 35 people come, so it takes a little while, but it's a lot of fun. Come do the white elephant. All right, workouts for the week. I got the tablet here so I can look and remember. Monday, we're gonna do, uh, we're gonna use our friends, the C2 bikes. We're gonna use those that you must stand on them to RX, and you have to get the calories done in a certain amount of time, and then we do some back squats. It should be a, uh, a good start to the week for your legs because on Tuesday, we're going to take 10 minutes, 10 minutes, only find a three rep front squat right into a three rep overhead squat. Now, some might say, well, why are we squatting after we just got done doing, because we're going to do a bunch of squats on Monday. Well, most people, the overhead squats, you're not going to get really heavy for the legs. And maybe even for a lot of people, you're not going to get really heavy for the legs for the front squats. So we're going to do sets of three of those. And then we get the legs even more with some box jumps and some jumping squats and some box step overs. So your legs after Monday and Tuesday should be finished. And then on Wednesday, we're going to do um, a repeat workout. We did this one last year. So if you were, have a score in there, uh, you can check for it. But it's a lot of Turkish get-ups and Russian kettlebell swings. 
It's like a long chipper where the, the reps decrease each of those, but a lot of Turkish get-ups. And then our partner workout on Thursday is actually a team of three workout where there's just a bunch of stuff and you can break it up however you want. You can partition it however you want. All three people are working at the same time. You do not need to do it in order. You just need to somehow get it all done, communicate with your team and uh, get the work done. And then on Friday is, oh, a max effort Friday. So for those that have been here a long time, we usually have max effort Mondays. One minute max reps this, one minute max reps that, blah, 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 for like three or four movements, five movements, and you get a minute rest. But we're doing that on a Friday this week instead of a Monday. And it's uh, max reps, sumo of high pole, bike, hang power snatch, toes to bar, and strict press. Oops, have a good week, Grush.